Yeah, Danila, as you said, today is their first day back, and as you can tell, you can hear the sirens, I'm sure. The parade is starting, and the seniors will be through in just a moment. We'll show you that. Try to get through this real quick so you can watch that. Now, as students go back to school, they will have to follow procedures designed to prevent spreading the coronavirus. So before they get inside the school, they have to get to the school, of course, so transportation, bus transportation, will be different this year. So now the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention is enforcing that people use masks while using public transportation. This includes students on school buses, and that policy is currently set to end on September 14th. And representatives for Corinth School District said they will follow this order until then. If students do not bring masks onto the bus, they will get some on the bus. And if students don't follow that mask policy, they will get reported to school administrators. The superintendent said they're asking students to comply because it's very hard to distance on the bus. It's very difficult to social distance on, on school buses or any public transportation. And so therefore, um, you know, that's why we're going to ask that our students um, comply um, with that order. Now, if your student will ride the bus in the mornings, keep in mind there is a shortage on bus drivers right now in the district. So the, the drivers will probably have to combine routes as needed to make up for that. But right now, as you can see, this is a time of celebration. So let's watch a little bit of this parade live right here as they come by. Here come the seniors. They're going to come around this SUV right here and you can see them very... Here they come, and the crowd goes wild. There they are, Big 12. Wow. Oh yeah, good morning. So that's what it's like here in Corinth right now. Now coming up, in the, coming up in the next half hour, we'll tell you more about what it will be like for students as they go about uh, the school year inside school starting today. So for now, reporting live in Corinth. Hey guys, good morning. Y'all excited? <laughs> All right, reporting live in Corinth, Bronson Woodruff, WTVA 9 News. We'll see you in about a half hour.